Modern aluminum castings are amazingly consistent in both density and accuracy, but they are still mass-produced components and they all have flaws. Porosity is a casting of flaw we encounter on a daily basis here at Millennium Technologies. Porosity happens when gas gets trapped in the aluminum during the casting process. These tiny bubbles of gas remain hidden in the casting until the casting is machined. When the cylinder is machined as new, or when a used cylinder is stripped, bored, or welded while being repaired, these gas bubbles are uncovered and look like tiny pits in the cylinder. These porosity pits are normal, and quite a bit of porosity is completely acceptable. We work with several major OEMs for production, prototype, and racing cylinder applications. This diagram shows the acceptable OEM porosity levels for new OEM cylinders. The misconception is that porosity pits are a bad thing. Everybody wants to see that perfectly smooth cylinder. The fact is, some porosity is actually a very good thing. Porosity pits fill with oil, creating a better ring seal and lowering the coefficient of friction. In some F1 racing applications, pits are laser honed into the cylinder for this very reason. Another misconception is that a ring will catch on the porosity pit. The reality is, ring tension is spread across the entire cylinder. If rings do not catch on two-stroke cylinder ports, they won't catch on porosity pits. Another misconception is that porosity pits will be filled in when the cylinder is plated. Nickel silicone carbide plating is an electrochemical process that applies an even amount of plating to the surface of the cylinder. It doesn't matter if the cylinder is smooth or pitted. Nickel silicone carbide plating will only fill in the porosity pits to the same depth as the plating on the cylinder. It doesn't fill in the pits like a liquid. We are asked all the time if we can fix porosity. Well, the answer is yes, but why would you want to? We could weld up and machine porosity pits, or we could apply an extreme amount of plating to fill in the porosity and then hone the cylinder back to size. But both of these solutions would be costly and have side effects that will cause way more problems than the porosity itself. We have an amazing QC department here at Millennium Technologies, and we check every cylinder that leaves the building. If you receive a cylinder with some porosity pits, don't sweat it. We have checked the cylinder, and based on 20 years of experience and extensive testing, we gave your cylinder a passing grade. There are times, especially with vintage cylinders, in which porosity exceeds acceptable levels. In those cases, we will call and discuss options.